Hey! <laughs> so, <laughs> I look, I know, I look like, I don't know, I look terrible. I haven't even brushed my hair, but I wanted to come on here and say, hey, I just got back from vacation yesterday evening, July 5th, and I was gone for 10 days. Whew, I feel like I need a vacation for my vacation, for sure. It was so much fun. I think I had a little bit too much fun, but it was my husband and myself and then my two boys and then my daughter-in-law and then my son's girlfriend and then we had some um, another couple that we usually just hang out with here and they came and we had the best time just hanging out with each other on the beach so I spent 10 days I feel like in the Sun and I'm so I, ha I have absolutely no makeup on right now which is obvious but I was really proud of myself because I didn't burn my face. But when I got home, I have a couple packages and I wanted to show you what I got in the mail that are cla what's craft related and also what I pretty much worked on in the morning while I was gone every morning until I decided to get out of, get off the bed. So, um I'm gonna turn the camera around so you don't have to look at this anymore. And I'm gonna show you what I got in the mail. We'll open them together. See you in a minute. All right, this is a package that I ordered off of Etsy. And I'm gonna put the camera down, open it up, and I will tell you about it. Okay, here it is. This is a shaker resin cover minder or keychain. I got the cover minder. I actually think I could use it as a needle minder too, but it has you know the two magnets on the back, and it's a Sunday, isn't it so cute? And it's made out of resin, and it has the things in there that you can shake, and it's like an ice cream Sunday. And this is something that I ordered from Marge Franklin. She has an Etsy store called. Tigger scrap, tigger scraps. T i g g e r s c r a p s. I'll get the invoice out. But these, this was, I've seen these a lot more, cost a lot more money than what she's charging. She has lots of different ones. So I got this while I was gone, and it has little hearts in there. Floating hearts. Let me shake it up. Yeah, pretty cool, huh? And this is my, it's in my hand so you can see how big it is. Okay, let me um, get out the receipt. All right, I'm just going to focus on this. But this is the Etsy store name and the address to get to her Etsy store. I think this is a custom, but I'm not really sure. Or like she, it was a made to order kind of thing. I didn't really customize it. I just said, make me one. Yeah, it's so cute, right? And this is the second one I've ordered from her. All right, let me get into my next package. All right, my next thing is a pin that I won off of a place called Poshy Pins. This is a handmade diamond painting pin, and the owner, I think there's two, Nicole and Stacy, but Nicole usually posts the pins and then like draws for them like the next day, and she does a really good job. So that's the name of the pin, Poshy Pins. And this is how it came. 
packaged. That's a cute little label. So let's see what's in here. I'm excited. Oh, this is cool. The pen came in this nice little case here and I got some candies. It's like a velvety feeling little um, pouch. The Before I take it out, I'll tell you what Hold on, what did I get? It's a hybrid pen. It's called Hybrid Neon Lights. So let me take, put down my phone and take it out so you can see it. Here it is, that is so cool. It's like, I guess it's called hybrid because it looks like wood or maybe, is it wood? I don't think it's wood, but it's like, it looks different, this end to this end. This is the neon lights part, I guess. Pretty. So, I really like this. She has a lot of cool looking pens. So thanks, Nicole and Poshy Pins, Nicole and Stacy. I mean, I love it. And this is what I worked on for the entire time that I was gone, pretty much. I doesn't look like I've done a lot, but I, I feel like I have. But you're starting to see the part of the the bird the bird's head with a Santa hat. It's a Santa hat. And these, this is a full beaded cross stitch or beaded embroidery piece. And I'll give you a little hint. I ordered another one. It'll be a while before it gets here, but I ordered another one because I really enjoy doing this. Let's just take a closer look. These are all beads. God, my nails are so distracting right now. This, I had to turn the flash on because it's cloudy. I don't mind that it's cloudy because I've had, like I said, a few days of sun. So I'm kind of ready for it to be cloudy. But yeah, I've messed up a few places. It's not the neatest job, but it's my first beaded cross stitch like this. And... I like it. I like seeing the picture just come together. But yeah, I still haven't finished even one full page. There's four pages. But you can see how big this part comes out a little bit more. I think like probably about that much more. But it's, it's supposed to be centered in the middle of this thing. So you can tell how big it's actually going to be probably like from here. And then down. I think this is halfway. All right. So I ordered this. Um, I talked about this before, but I got this beaded cross stitch from a place on on Facebook. It's called Biser Painting, B I S E R. But on Etsy, it's called Beads Painting. I I believe that's correct. But um, if you go on Facebook and put in visor painting, then you it'll come up. And then I think they also put a link to the Etsy store there. So, really liking it. This is my Christmas. This is a Christmas picture, and so I'm working on it. I really wanted to work on it during July. So, I have. I have been. So, this is basically my, what's it called? Jolly July. And that's it. <laughs> that's all I worked on. For the past 10 days. Actually, I take that back. I have worked a little bit on another one, which I'll show you later on, but not it's not enough to even show because it's just not. But I just I'm really, really, really liking these because it's like cross stitch and it's beads and they shine. Yep, and there's lots of you can tell shading and stuff. It's just really kind of cool how it comes together. Okie dokie. So I'm going to go. 
and I just wanted to come on here and say hi and let you know why I've been gone, what I've been doing, and I'm back, and I that was my vacation for the summer, and I'm probably, I don't think I'm going anywhere else until September, maybe. Depends on everything. Okay, and maybe in the next video I'll sound a little bit more energetic. Bye, y'all.